Oh, I sat on my feet and they hurt. Oh, I think they're broke. Hey guys, it's Drew and I am back with a new video. This one is a spring, sort of spring essentials for um, men's fashion, of course, for 2014. Um, I had a few requests here and on my Twitter account, to sort of like the basics or essentials this spring, also mixing in patterns and textures and just sort of like the trends, I guess, things that are going to be happening or you're going to possibly be seeing this spring. And I wanted to bring that to you, so I have a mix of different items, and then at the end of the video, I will be having three different outfits that I paired using these mix of items. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, you guys, it always helps. And let's get started. I have a floral print. So this is a nice floral print. It's sort of very muted floral print tee from Top Man. I'm obsessed with the rolled cuffs, as you guys have probably seen. I showed this in pre prior videos. But um, floral print's definitely going to be in this spring, whether it be sort of the, the more typical floral or it transitions into a more Hawaiian sort of tropical floral. But this one's very muted and it's a great color palette, I think, for spring. It'll keep you really cool, especially with the rolled sleeves. This is the shirt I'm wearing. It's just a plain pink shirt, as you can probably see. It has a little bit of a pocket here. I also rolled up the sleeves, just as the other one, as I've been doing with most of my sleeves. Pink is definitely going to be in this year. It was voted number one men's color of the year, and it's just going to be seen a lot lately in either dress shirts, um, just plain shirts, pants, really any men's wardrobe accessory, I guess you can say. You don't, you don't have to go for the like basic pink color. This one's sort of an off pink. It's sort of more, I don't know, I feel like there's a little bit of brown tones in here, and I am obsessing over pink. I don't know why, even though like, it's for girls. The chambray button-up, I also think, is a great piece for spring, you guys. You should definitely have one of these in your wardrobe because you can literally layer it under, over, or wear it by itself. There's so many different ways to wear this shirt that um, it's very timeless. You can always keep it in your wardrobe and transition from spring to fall and to the colder climates as well with layering. And a great aspect of this one is it has a little bit of a... Um, a cuff to sleep and it has a little clasp to hold your cuff for you. And I'm also loving the distressing that this one also features on the shirt. If it gets a little chilly where you guys are in the springtime, I definitely suggest having a very lightweight jacket. This one is from, for, uh, actually from H&M. And it's just a denim bodice jacket with the sort of sweatshirt material sleeves and hoods going to be like um, appropriate for the day, if it's pretty hot in the morning, but you're gonna go out, maybe into the night, it's a little bit cooler, you can throw on your shop or not your chambray, but your denim um, jacket, and it'll just keep you a little bit warm at night, and I think it's a simple piece to just have for the spring. Any lightweight jacket, but especially because this one has the sweatshirt slash denim, I think it's a really, really great um, lightweight piece, guys. These are a pair of patterned shorts from H&M. I got them quite a while back and they're from the Conscious Collection. I'm not exactly sure what that means, but oh well, I liked the print. It's sort of like a tribal Aztec print. I don't know. Um, I think short shorts are, shorts are just seem to be getting shorter as the years go on in men's fashion at least, but these ones are a great piece to have. Anything printed, maybe with more pastel neutral colors um, would be great to pair with your um, other top pieces. These ones are um, from a website, I'm not exactly sure, I got them a long time ago, but they're just a mint green chino um, short, and they have a back welt pocket on them, and then a front little glass pocket, which I love. And these ones are really fun just because of the color, they're sort of a pack, they're, well, they are a pastel color, but great for the springtime, I think. You have probably seen these around like 150,000 times this year, but they're the jogger pants. But what I think that's going to be really cool for the springtime is to roll up the bottom of the jogger pant. And because it has that cinching on the bottom, it will still keep its form when it's rolled. So if you roll it up, it will still cinch around your leg because that cinching is still intact on the inside of that area um, than having it on your whole leg. But um, just a simple pair of jogger pants. These ones are from Zara, and I think they were like $40. They're just a neutral gray tone. They'll go greatly with all of your um, toms. I have toms. I don't know why, I've been loving toms. Literally from the past two weeks ago, I pulled out my toms, and I'm like, I'm going to be wearing these a lot. So just toms slip-ons, and then I have a pair of toms, like lace-up toms. These ones are brown and distressed, and I don't know. These, I don't think they have a style number or anything, but 
these ones I just I added some spice to just to add a little bit of my own personal touch. I actually have a DIY video you guys can check it out right there if you want to see it. Lastly are a few accessories. I have just a pair of aviators. These are from Ray-Ban and um, aviators seem to be making a comeback. I know I had these stashed away for quite a while just because they weren't really, I, I didn't really want to wear them and recently I've been seeing them a lot lately so I pulled out these. They have a gold frame on them and metallic lenses which is also super hot right now are the metallic lens glasses as you see. I want some more. I want some silver ones but these will work for now I guess. And last but not least is just dainty bracelets. I have this one is from Top Man. It's just a simple little cross. I don't even know if you can see that, but it's just a little tiny cross bracelet. This one's like a gunmetal color and just a simple bracelet. We'll add a little bit of an accessory to any outfit, a little bit of shine. thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment below on what you guys are going to be rocking this spring season and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter at I'm Drew Scott and you can check out my fashion blog where I post many lookbooks and um, sort of outfit of the day posts all the time at I'mDrewScott.com. All links are in the down bar below. Thanks so much guys and I'll catch you all next time. Bye everybody.